My name is Zach Santiago, and I play a character named Nicholas Maestro Martinez. That's two times I've let you kill my family. Let the election God I have them. I'm not going to call him a villain, uh, but he's pretty serious about what he does and what he wants, and will stop at nothing to achieve his goals, and might have to cross a few lines. Well, the story's got a few flashbacks. So the, where we pick up for him first time is about two years before where yeah, the bulk of the movie starts. Oh, you might have come to the right place. He is uh, an entrepreneur. He has a good heart, but sometimes he has to find ulterior motives and ways to um, make ends meet. It's a prison scene. Um, there's a character who I have a very special relationship. She's like a nemesis, but also um, a lover. Um, so uh, there's a lot of things going on, a lot of subtext in the scene. Feliz Navidad, mi amor. I have been thinking about you. When you can have a scene like that that isn't just like black or white, and when you have a scene partner who is as strong as my partner in this scene, she's really, really gifted. Um, it, uh, it really sizzles. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a joy. In between takes, um, sometimes if you want to sort of disconnect a little bit just to preserve a part of you, um, or if it's really a more physically based thing, like when we're doing stunt things and you want to breathe and cool down and kind of get back in that zone and focus on the choreography for the stunt work. If it's really emotional stuff or if the character is very complicated, I, I like to not get too much out of character because I, because I don't want to have to go too far to have to get back to that place again. This love is real. No one will ever be able to come close to what we have. The quema, no? It burns like a fire that will not die. Everyone's got their own process. So for me, between takes, it kind of depends on the nature of the character, the nature of the project, and what sort of scene we're filming at the time. So if you're really into the holiday stuff, there'll be, be moments of that kind of family and that notion and that celebration in there for you. And if you're into the the forbidden love or the new love or can't you see he likes you, you're gonna get that. And if you want a good bang em up movie with um, are they gonna get there in time sort of thing, you're gonna have that too. So um, it's something you can watch on your own and be satisfied if you like one of those things. Or if you're with a group of people who likes only one genre, everyone's gonna be happy, right? So, so I think it's kind of the perfect um, all in one film. I have a deep respect for our stunt departments, our stunt coordinators. I've been a stunt performer and double myself, and I'm a former fighter. I boxed for almost 25 years, so I like the physicality. There's such a dance involved with a lot of fight I scenes in action movies, or how cars are going to work, or with effects. This, um, when done properly, it just brings a whole other level to, to the drama, or to the story, or to the writing, to the word. So uh, I think good action, um, it's hard to achieve, but when done right, it's, it's magical.